Hello, this is Ghada al Kurdi, freelancer journalist from Gaza City. It's been more than 73 days since the beginning of the war, of the Israeli war against Gaza Strip. I moved from Gaza City towards Khan Yunus City, south of Gaza Strip. I left some of my family, they still in, in, in Gaza City and north of Gaza. Since the, the beginning of the war, uh, almost 20,000 of uh, Palestinian people have been killed and the injuries, it's like more than 50,000. Uh, the Israeli forces uh, have committed many massacres against the civilians in all over of Gaza governorates. Uh, some, some of the families have been whipped out from the civil records here in, in Gaza Strip. Uh, and some of them, they still under the rubble and no one uh, can go and uh, bring them out. Uh, number or statistics uh, is not clear yet, but we still, uh, the Minister of Health is still counted the number of fatalities in, in Gaza Strip. Uh, because of the bad connection and network, uh, I cannot reach my family in north of Gaza. I have no news about them. I have my father, my sister, and my daughters. They still over there, and I try. Uh, I'm trying many times to call them, but I couldn't have any information or any updates about their situation uh, in north of Gaza. Uh, here in Khan Yunis, uh, the Israeli military operation is still, is still ongoing, targeting uh, many buildings, residential buildings, targeting hospitals, streets, even the drones, uh, they called it uh, quadcopter uh, drones, they targeting civilian by uh, sniper them. Regarding uh, the humanitarian situation, uh, Gaza Strip uh, have been divided to three parts. Uh, north of Gaza, in Gaza City, it's in one area, middle area and south of Gaza City. Uh, regarding the supplies, we have uh, a few amounts of uh, food, uh, water even, which is polluted all, all, all the time. And it's uh, when you try to go to market or any local market, uh, the food and the supplies are uh, so, so expensive and even it's very rare.